Spencer, do you have something to say to the camera? I'm going to hit a golf ball. What muscles are you going to use? A lot. Well, to be exact, Spencer's using his hamstrings to maintain good golf posture, his quadriceps to maintain knee flexation throughout the swing, his latissimus dorsi to keep his upper spine erect for ease of rotation, his external obliques for a stronger turn, his deltoid for better control of the club throughout the swing, and his flexors and extenders in his wrists for stronger impact position and no breakdown within the wrists. Spencer, do you have anything else to say to the camera? I'm going to hit another one. Did you hit that last one good? Yeah. Are you going to hit this one better? How was that? So we're here with Spencer Summers as he prepares for the PGA Tour. He has graciously given us his time to walk through the steps of his golf swing. A 40 inch yardstick will be his weapon of choice, and his goal, to embarrass Tiger Woods even more. As you can see, Spencer sets up by bending his hamstrings and quadriceps to keep him elevated. As he begins his swing, his latissimus dorsi and external oblique rotate. Also, his deltoid abducts. Then as his swing comes down, his deltoid adducts and his flexors flex. The final result requires his extensor muscles to extend and the ball to go miles and miles. That's right, that's son. For Spencer so We have Justin getting ready to show us some exercises to strengthen the muscles that are involved in the golf swing. First, he's going to do a nice little shoulder circuit, strengthen up the deltoid. Next, we have Justin doing lap pull downs to strengthen the latissimus dorsi. Another exercise we have here is tricep extensions to strengthen the triceps. Lastly, we have Justin doing some crunches to strengthen his abdominals. Like the common injuries in golf is tendonitis and um, sprains here, elbow, wrist, hand, back, knee, and shoulder. You can also get a strained neck or arthritis, or in rare cases you can tear a ligament.